Praise the Lord, people of God. Hallelujah. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah. Before I will start my testimony, I will first of all beg for forgiveness for measure because I'm giving the testimony too late. It was since 2018 that it happened. So I want to beg measure our, our father that I'm sorry because I ought to give this testimony because when the child was sick, I was running to the ministry for him to bless the child and deliver her. So now the child is now, well, I did not come earlier to give the testimony. So I want to say, Major, I'm sorry. Forgive me, Major. Amen. So my testimony goes like this. I'm called Brother Emmanuel Azo Abanda. This is my daughter called Azo Sophia. We are from Manfi, but right now we reside at Buddha. So my testimony is, before this, my daughter was put to birth. There was a very big problem that happened to her. So when they put her to birth, she encountered an illness that we could not understand where the illness was coming from. So I struggled in the quarter with the traditional doctors taking some herbs from them to give the child to get well, to no avail. But right there, I was having my daughter's TV in my house, watching it every day. But the devil was keeping closing my eyes to see what I can go and take deliverance. So I was keeping on spending money buying traditional herbs around the area. But I could not know that there was a grace located in the channel. But one day when I was in my room watching the channel, a spirit jumped at me. I, I look at this channel. I see a different thing. I say, hey, my daughter is ill. Why should I not carry her to this prophet? Upon the miracle that he's doing like this, her, why can I not go there and take the miracle also? That spirit told me, ah, Allah, you don't go anywhere. See too, that man is not a true man of God. I continued giving her traditional help in the, in the, in the area. To know where all my money got finished. Before the Holy Spirit entered me now, one day, I took my bag. I picked running. I took a vehicle from my area, direct to Bamenda. I took a, 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 a Okada from, from the park, direct to my, 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 to LGM. As I entered to LGM, Major, Major was healing, giving healing during del delivery time. Major approached us. When he looked at me the first time, he saw me. He said, what is happening with that child? I said, Major, I'm tired too. I don't know. Major spoke to me. He said, as you enter here, you have gone to the toilet with the China. I said, yes, Major. He said, the child is sending out uh, watery feces. And when the feces comes out, it cements. I said, yes, Major. Major, yes. I was surprised how he was just giving what I was going through with the child. I said, hey, my God, this is a real prophet. I was doubting the faith. Now I've come to see it. Major told me that there is something that happened when they give birth to this child. Before the child was to be given birth, he was being cursed in the stomach. So the, 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 the person who cursed her, he said that I will not work money and hold money with my hand. So that money will be passing. Every time I hold money, the money will pass. So I shouted, make sure as we pray now, I will see the miracle that will happen to the child. So I was blessed to have the anointing water and the uh, anointing oil. So when Major came, he said, I should take a cup of the anointing oil and gave it to the, to the child. I gave her the cup of the anointing oil. So he drank it. And Major prayed for her and prophesied to me and said, let me go. I will see what will happen. The person tormenting the child, if the person does not repent and give his life to Christ, the person will not succeed. If the person repent, then it will happen. Let me go. I will see the miracle. So I took my anointing oil and my anointing water. I went home with it. I was praying and believing God. You could not see this child and realize he was a, a human being. He was just like an animal in the forest. You know what they call Pachaco? He was having big stomach, as you see like that, and tiny legs. And the, the hairs on the head were not even black as this, like this now. Because of the prayer and middle prayer. You can see the hairs now are very black. And it's very, she's very healthy now. So... When I went back to the house, I was praying and administering this anointing water and anointing oil. I started seeing the power rising the child from where she was, from that crankiness that she was cranky. And she could not even speak well and stand well. She started developing some freshness in her. So from there, she developed strongness in her. So I really thank God for the grace that located me under LGM. Because even of this grace, this child could not be alive today. As you can see, the child, this is a testimony for me. I'm very happy. 
because I've spent money with her until I'm tired. But God located, God located me under General DDC Alo, and she blessed me with the deliverance of this child. Praise the Lord. Praise Master Jesus. So viewers all over the world, my mother and my fathers, whether we are having children like this, when we encounter an illness to a child, they will not just go to any direction. First of all, seek the kingdom of God, and you will see what will happen. After that, 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 that second, you will say, God, God will direct you the right side to go, to deliver the child and to heal the child. As I pray, hallelujah.